with Jess. It's time for Law Enforcement Recognition on Blue Friday, and today you've got a twofer for us that involves some interesting sports. Tell us about it. So every week, Chasing News and New Jersey 101.5 honor law enforcement with hashtag Blue Friday. Blue Friday uh, highlights the wonderful jobs that men and women in uniform do. And uh, there are a lot to get to this week, so first let's start with Team Caitlin. State Trooper James Regan will be jumping into the Delaware River on Saturday. Every thousand dollars that we raise, they basically send about 65 athletes to like uh, regional um, uh, athletic events, you know, where they compete against each other. Freezing for a reason at the Lehigh Valley Polar Bear Plunge to support athletes competing in the Special Olympics and his friends will be there for support. If it takes me getting to a Speedo to get her to the right uh, denominations win, then that's what I'll do. I'll borrow my father's Speedo and make it work. And we also have this. Saturday, Toms River and Camden County Police will play a charity ice hockey game that uh, they're going to come together for the brother, Brett Hansen. In all likelihood, Brett's never going to uh, be able to be a police officer again. So uh, it's really incumbent upon us to, to raise his family up and raise funds for him to offset some of his uh, medical costs. This January, Toms River police officer Brett Hansen was in a car accident on his way home from work, and he is now in a coma. You know, we went on many calls together, Brett. Um, He's a good person. He always had my back, and I feel the obligation to have his back now. Brett had worked for both the Camden County Police and for Toms River Police, which is why the two are facing off in an ice hockey game. If you can't attend the game, you can still contribute. Brett Hansen's mother has started a GoFundMe page for friends to contribute to his medical bills. You can search Blue Friday on Facebook or Twitter if you want to know more.